Okay, let's talk about the first 50 digits of E. It's a pretty important number. Euler came up with it, so let's just memorize the first 50 digits. I mean, obviously, this kind of looks like a lot of digits right here, uh, but it's not, it's really not. Because we're going to break it down into colors. Okay, also, um, uh, this is the first 51 digits, technically, because I wanted to show this 9 here to show that I'm truncating, not rounding, because I think that that is a better idea if we're going to memorize them. Because why would you memorize a wrong digit? Uh, that's stupid. So let's go through them. Uh, 2.7, you should know that. Uh, that's not something you should have to memorize now. You should already know it's 2.7. So let's just move on to the next one. Uh, 1828, 1828. This one's really easy because this is just going to go over here. 18 and then 28. You can memorize this section uh, just by saying 18 and then the 2 is 1 greater than the 1 and then it's another 8. So 18 and then 28. So 1828. The eights repeat, the one is just one more, and then now it's a two. And then that whole section just repeats into one eight two eight again. One eight two eight one eight two eight. Let's move on to the next one. Four five nine zero four five. Forty five and forty five again. Forty five plus forty five is equal to ninety, of course. So that's where the ninety comes from. The forty five is doubled because there's two of them, and then they make the ninety together. Um, that's really simple. 45, 90, 45. You can also remember it as an angle, two 45 angles and a 90, like a um, 45 angle right triangle. And then two, three, five, three. This one's kind of weird. Um, you got to get the two and the three. You got to add them together and they're going to make a five. And then this three is just going to pull over here. So 23, 53. The three, the unit digit in those two are the same. And then the five comes from the two plus the three. Let's move on to the next one. Uh, 6028. Uh, six, 60 and 28 are both two digits. So we know those are both two digits. And so we're going to have to use a 2 twice. So we're going to first use the 2 to divide 60. We're going to get 30. And then we're going to use the 2 to subtract from 30 to get 28. So it is 60 and then 28 because you're dividing the 60 by 2 and then you're subtracting 2 from a 30 to get 28. So that's pretty simple. Uh, let's move on to the next one. 747. Seven. Okay, so everyone likes to do air travel. Uh, everyone, uh, well, some people don't, I guess. You could get air sick. But 747 uh, is just a plane. Um, it's the Boeing. Let's move to the next one. 135. One plus three. Just kidding. We're going to do odd. This is just the first three odd digits. One and then three and then five. Just like the first three, even just two, four, and then six. But now these are one, three, five. And now we got 2662. This is just a palindrome. 26, and then you flip it, and now it's 62. You can think about it like 26 looking through a mirror. So 26 looking into that mirror, and it's going to see a 62 on the other side. And that is the number you need to know, 2662. 49. It's a football team. Um, it's in San Francisco. Uh, this, this is my best drawing of a football player. Um, yeah, yeah. That's that's all I have to say. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's go to the next one. Seven seven five seven. Uh, seventy seven. That's easy. Seventy seven. Uh, same number. It's divisible by eleven. It's cool. Um, and but then to get this five seven, we're gonna do seven minus two because seventy seven's got two digits. And then we're gonna need five. Okay. Okay. That's pretty easy for the five. But then the seven. Where does that come from? Oh, you're just gonna pull the unit digit again. Just pull the unit digit. We did that up here, and we're doing it again. Um, so it's 77, and then you subtract 2 from a 7 to get 5, and then you pull the 7 to get a 7 again. So 77, 57. You can memorize it like that. 24 and 70. Okay, this one's a little bad, because um, it's not that great. But uh, basically, I just think 24 times 3 is approximately 70. It's not actually 70. But um, I, I won't tell anybody if you don't. So let's just move on to the next one. Just remember, 24 times 3 is kind of close to 70. That's good enough. Just memorize it. 9, 3, 6. This one's nice. 9 minus 3 equals 6. You can also just remember this is, I mean, they're all multiples of 3. That's also cool. So just doing mine, 9, this, minus this, it's going to give you this. It's real simple. Nine 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 five, triple nines, and we got a five. 
I would just remember it like that. There's not really a trick to this one as far as I know. You just do like 999. That's pretty simple. Everyone knows 999. And then 5. That's just a 5. It's just, it's just 5. It's chilling. Um, so that's that's it. That's the first that's the first 50 digits. I mean, good for you. This is not going to take that long to remember. I did it in like 10 minutes. This video is probably shorter than 10 minutes. So, um, you can do this. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all. Uh, you should totally check out my other videos. Okay, okay, bye. Bye, bye, bye.